So this is absolutely nuts. It's absolutely crazy. Scientist Dr. Yoshihiro Kawota has before recreated the flu pandemic that killed 500,000 people. However, he's now improved the strains of Spanish flu that he had and he's made it resistant to the human system's antibodies completely resistant. Now before this flu killed 500,000 people but that was not enough for this guy. It was killing maybe 1 in 10 people that contracted it but now humans will have no resistance to this new brand of super flu that he's created now ostensibly as it says here his goal is to perfect the design of flu vaccines of the future but in order to achieve it the scientist has enabled the virus to escape the human immune system completely. Now how mad is this? Now the fact that you've got a lab with a virus capable of killing most of the world's population is one thing and this basically is in Madison but the fact that he now is going to publish a paper about it and that paper is going to tell other people how to replicate his experiments and it's going to tell other people how to produce pandemic type flus that we don't have any resistance to at all it's mad because I'm sorry not all terrorists are people who cower in caves in Afghanistan. Some terrorists are very sophisticated. Some terrorists have degree level education in things like bioscience, electronics. I mean the whole thing is so dangerous it's incredible. I mean this is the one example of scientific research that should be jumped on, suppressed, the experiment should be taken apart, the results of it destroyed and the whole thing should never ever see the light of day and he should definitely never be able to publish a paper and he himself to be honest should be kept under guard for the rest of his life because this madman has the potential to destroy all human life on earth it's just nuts Anyway, see you again soon.